Hello, everyone. How are we doing? Remember last episode? We were here. This is where we were. We tried to jump down into the well to visit Samara, but all it did was kill us, and we ended up in over here. So that's what we're doing. Uh, let's see what we got on supplies before we see what's through the doors. So we got uh, a little bit of oil. We'll actually have a little bit of oil. Um, we got 15 tinder cylinders. <laughs> They're not boxes. Um, we got some health. Still got a crank. Still got a jar. Still got a hammer and chipper. Still got our lantern. We got a slight headache and some cuts and bruises. So let's see where every door leads us. Let's see what's do through door number one. Let's see what's through door number two, I mean. <laughs> oh, okay, won't budge, so let's see what's in this one. Okay. Um, well, we'll save that door for now. Let's go through this door and see what's going on. Okay. Hey, a lever. What happened to us? Levers? Tinder cylinder. Really? A few drops of oil? Yeah, you're mean. Whatever. Oh, whatever. Okay. 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. <laughs> Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. I have changed the deal. Pray I do not change it anymore. What do these do? They're lovers. It's not working. Something must be wrong with the machinery. Well, let's just keep fuddling with it until something happens. And so I solve all my problems. Oh, this ain't working. Okay. Alright, well, maybe it's through door number two. Shut that one in case some spookum comes through it. Nice and shut. Okay, let's see what's through this door. I'm a little skittish. I'm a little skittish. Okay. Oh, man. That looks so happy. Let's just keep moving through the darkness. I can see pretty good. Okay. Next door. I'll light this up because Daniel's going insane. Okay. It just gets happier and happier. Down the stairs. I'm a skittish deer, that's what I am. Let's run down the stairs a little faster. I feel like something's gonna chase me here. Or I guess not. Okay. okay. I'm trying to maximize my tinder boxes. And so far it's um Yeah, we're doing okay. <laughs> we're doing okay, I think we're doing okay. We haven't really gotten screwed over yet. Ooh, winning! Anything else back here? Nope. Run, run, run. We are running now. I'm gonna look at this. Hey! Agrippa, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move. Will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? Clinking and clanking of little glass bottles. Ah. Okay, let's move on. I got a barrel. Don't screw with me! You ever take it to the face with a barrel? Eh. There's a wall there. Hello. Laboratory. That's not gonna budge. Okay. 
So we need, I'm guessing we need, here's our first puzzle, well, second puzzle, really. Um, we need to get through here. We need, we need Gordon Freeman here, that's who we need. Him and his crowbar action. Let's see, hey, a shovel! Will this work? This isn't kind of, maybe. Let's try. This is what I would do, I'd use a shovel! This would work! All I'd have to do is pry it, like, in like that, get it in there, just like that, and then you pull! Whoa! That ain't working. Maybe I can throw things at it. A barrel! Where'd it go? What happened to the... Where'd the barrel go? What the hell? <laughs> the game ate my barrel! Alright, whatever, let's move on. Hey, there's a guy right there. Zombie. Oh, he died. That sucks. Whatever. Whatever. Holy shit! Oh! Switch. <laughs> what? This switch? What is? Help me. This one? Thank you. You have my gratitude. My name is Agrippa. Who might you be? I am Daniel. Daniel? Like the prophet thrown into the lion's den? <laughs> Tell me, are you among the lion's den? You scared me. You want to stop Alexander? Oh my. So Babylon shall fall, you say. <laughs> You've hurried too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. He has one. That's... That's not very promising. Oh, the sanctum is... Oh, I'm sorry, Daniel. Basically a penetrant. But guess the why I... It could be breached by a battle. But Alexander broke his... I mean, my own. A long time ago. Really? Then, if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken arm and mend away. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leak matter, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the choir and the transept. You should be able to find them there. I can't throw things at him. That kind of sucks. Oh, whatever. I understood. We need to go find... An orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. It shattered pieces scatter around the torture rooms. Oh, this Dad, room. I hate to bother you first, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at me. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johan I, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion, a tonic to free me from this husky mind. I could, um, I could use you as a meat shield. That would be quite handy. Hey, oil. How many? What level? Oh, that level. So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe there's another room. There are machine parts in all over this place. You'll find a way to fix it. Hey. to get in there. Cool. Who, me? I'm Heinrich Cornelius Agrippi. I was once quite important to you. I bet you were. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in this dead husk for years. Who knows how many? How oh my god, you? Heimlich, shut up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go this way. It cannot be open from here. Alright, we'll try this one. It cannot be open from here. Alright. Heavy door is blocking the path. The grip is a dying man. <sighs> okay. Nine minutes, ten minutes in? I can go a little farther. No, don't kill her. Oh 
Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> See that fleeing skills? You got nothing on this. I don't know what you were saying, but whatever. Okay. So nothing's in here. Right. Got two staircases up. What's going on over here? A door. Doors are important. Pointless room! Awesome! I do love me some pointless rooms. You pointless rooms as well? They're like little, um... That's what I'm looking for. Little, um... Insanity places. Those little rooms you see. Tommy knockers, Tommy knockers, knocking at my door. Okay. Oh! <gasps> I saw you trying to hide from me, little tinderbox. What were you thinking? Come here. Here we go. Let's look for goodies. We do love them. Hello. Picked up meat. Winning. I say that a lot. I should probably slow down on that. Using the word winning. <laughs> I sound like a bro. Okay. Um. Oh. I know this. I've been here already. I know this taste. A taste of Damascus Rose obfuscating the truth in the dim haze. They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body remembers this thing. These cuts speak volumes, even though my mind remains silent. They will be back. Oh, they will be back. little flashbacks. I understand the game's amnesia and you- Ooh! ADD. I know this game is amnesia and it's, you know, he's having flashbacks and all that stuff. They are annoying at times. Oh, come on, Daniel. That didn't even scare me. And I'm a very skittish deer. That was just silly. Chair. And I think we're gonna end the episode here with that. I think we've made it long enough. And we're gonna try one attempt to get the chair stuck on the chandelier. Here we go! And we failed. Okay. Yeah, 13 minutes. I think that's enough. Next episode, we'll go through this door. And we will see what horrors await us. Have a good one, guys.